Hello YouTube, do you want to edit videos like this guy, this guy, or this guy? Well if you want to, keep watching this video, because this is how to edit exe video on Premiere Pro. Well I have ever done it before, but I think I didn't make it good enough, so this is for you. Like, for you. So let's get start. So if you ask me, how do I get clips? Well simply just record your gamma play by the application that I put it on the screen. They all are the good apps to record your screen, and I will show you how to use them right now. Let's start with GeForce Experience. So to open the menu, press Alt Z. As you can see, I'm recording with it right now. When you need to record your screen, you can easily press Alt F9. It will start recording. How easy is that? Next is about the setting. The setting is right here. Click it. You can set your quality of the recorder. And where can you set your record file location? Come into setting. This menu will appear. Click on recording. In here, you can set the record location in your folder. And that's all for GeForce experience. Next is Ob Studio. As you can see, in Ob Studio you can do stuff like this. But let's talk about the record. When you first download OBS Studio, everything will be black. To fix this, you will have to add display capture. You can name the thing you write here. Click OK. And now you know. How do I record the videos? Now, how do I get sound effect? So first, go to YouTube. Click on the sound effect that you like. Then go to URL. Copy it. Do like I said in previous tutorial. Go to any mp3 downloader website. But I recommend choose mp3 juices. Go to your mp3 downloader website. Paste the URL. Download it. Now for the green screen and media. Like I said in last video, you will need 4K video downloader. I will paste the link in the description. Go download it. So, to download, do everything like when you download sound effect. So first open your Premiere Pro. And to edit, you have to open new project. You can name project right here. Then click OK. Once you here, you will need to import your file right here. And to edit, drag your file to timeline. So the first tool you're gonna need is the razor tool. You can press C to use it. Razor tool is used to cut the part of the video. You can delete the selected video part by clicking the timeline and right click it. As you can see there's a clear and Rippler delete. Rippler delete will delete the timeline that you selected and delete it, but it also will make it stick to the video that you cut it. If you still don't understand, go try it by yourself and clear it just delete the selected part. Nothing much but I recommend using Rippler delete. And that's it for clearing the part of the video. So first, drag your background video or image to the timeline. Also get your green screen video. Yeah like that. Then go to effect bar, and search for ultra key. Drag it to the timeline. Then go to effect control, and press this thingy. Go here at playback. Click on green screen. <laughs> 